Welcome back to Couch Collectibles. Hope you guys are having a great day. In this video, we are going to look at 1975 Lincoln pennies that are worth money. Don't forget, if you want to win this silver Morgan dollar, all you guys got to do is click the link in the description. It takes you to a page. You click the two little green things, subscribe to those two channels, and you are entered two times for the silver Morgan dollar. So let's just hop into the video and check out these rare pennies that are worth money. All right, so first up is an obverse die break error. Now you will see that error taking place there by the word trust right on top of the word trust on the 1975 penny here now that is what people call a cud so a die break error a lot of people know that as being called a cud error so that will give the coin a little bit of value and that's why this penny sold for a little over $35 now, just to show you an example of a more extreme obverse die break taking place on a 1975 penny, you can see that there on the obverse, the front of the coin. Now, this penny here sold for a little over $50. Now, we're going to get more into higher value pennies here in just one second. Let's move on to another 1975. This is a Denver minted Lincoln cent. Now, this penny was struck 5% off center. You can see that both on the obverse and the reverse of the coin. And this penny here sold for over $50. Next up is another 1975 Denver minted Lincoln cent. Now, this has the obverse struck through a capped die. Now, this is just like the penny that I found in a coin roll from the bank the other day. If you guys missed that video, be sure to go check it out. It's a few videos back. It's an awesome, awesome coin that I found. And this penny here sold for a little over $50 as well. Next up is a 1975 Lincoln penny that was struck on a 10 cent planchet. So struck on a dime coin there. You can see that the whole design doesn't fit there, especially on the reverse United States of America doesn't all the way fit on that penny. And this penny only weighs 2.3 grams. Now a regular 1975 penny would weigh 3.11 grams. Now this 1975 Lincoln cent sold for a little over $300. Moving on to another error coin here. This is a 1975 Denver minted Lincoln cent that has been triple struck. Obviously you can see the error taking place. Probably not going to find this in a coin roll or circulation. Obviously, if someone sees this, they're going to get it out of circulation fairly quickly. But I just wanted to throw this in there to show you the different types of errors that does happen at the mint. Now, this penny here sold for over $160. Next up is another die break error. Now, this is a major die break taking place here on the 1975 Denver Minted Penny. Now, you can see that error both on the obverse and the reverse of the coin, and that's why this penny sold for a little over $50. Next up is another off-center error taking place on the 1975 Denver Minted Penny. Now, you can see that error taking place in the image display. And that's why this penny here sold for a little over $60. Here's a 1975 no mint mark. That means that it was produced in Philadelphia. It's a very, very high grade. You guys know the coin grading scale only goes up to 70. This is graded at a mint state 67 red. And this 1975 penny sold for over $800. But that's not it. If we take a look at the 1975 D at the same exact grade, this penny here sold for over $4,000. $4,000 penny. Hey guys, don't forget to go check out all my other coin and collectible videos on the channel. Until tomorrow, I will see you all in the comment section below. This is Couch Collectibles and this is where I disappear.